This Windows app is Microsoft's biggest failure in years. Find the article and read it for yourself. I'll include the link in the description. I respectfully disagree. But it's on the list. Have you heard of God Mode? We'll discuss it later. In the article, they're talking about the settings option in Windows. And yes, I agree. It's horrible. Is it the biggest failure? No. But yeah, like I said, it's on the list. The settings apps is ungodly slow. Yes. For those who are not knowledgeable, the settings apps make you play by Microsoft rules. Yes. Does it have a terrible interface? Yes. Is it severely limited where you can't open up two Windows settings at the same time? Yes. Which is absolutely stupid. Is it a continuous work in progress? Yeah, but that's not a big issue because that stuff's always changing. The settings app is supposed to be the replacement for the control panel. Eh, it sucks. <laughs> the settings app is everything that's wrong with Windows. <laughs> well, kind of, sort of. Of course, the workaround for this is God mode. So as you see here, I have an icon. It's the control panel on steroids. You double click it. And it gives you every option you could ever possibly think of to make changes to your computer. And there's the instructions on how to create God mode on your computer. It's really simple. You just create a new folder and then you copy that string of information there. And padam, there it is. And when you double click it, every command you can ever possibly think of. The only thing you can't do is rename that folder. It just won't let you name the folder. 